a young woman wakes up in a hotel covered in blood, not knowing how she got there, and discovers that only five people can actually see and hear her. Is she dead? Is she dreaming? Hotel Beau Séjour is really reminiscent of The Invisible, except it's way, way better. <music> This is a Belgian crime drama, and the main character is Kato. After waking up, pieces begin to fall into place, and really the mystery lies in why only certain people can hear and see her. She also begins to discover that her village isn't as peaceful as it appears. This is a multi-layered drama with a good amount of mystery to keep you really engaged. The actors are very convincing in their roles, and we get really convincing performances out of them. It's definitely gritty as Kato navigates feelings and relationships especially as she uncovers things that maybe she doesn't want to uncover. It's only 10 episodes long, and so it's very worth it to kill a day binge-watching. The reason I'm vague in a lot of this is because I don't want to give much away. It's really good to experience it and to unravel the mystery as you go along. Now, there are a couple of red herrings, and there are some good twists in it, so you can look forward to that. But otherwise, story-wise, I can't really tell you too much because, hey, you need to experience it, and I don't want to ruin it. I've been very impressed with the foreign Netflix original series that have been coming out. For the most part, they are very solid, well-written, and well-acted. I really loved Hotel Beau Séjour, even though it was dark and gritty. There is sex, nudity, profanity, and violence. I give Hotel Beau Séjour four out of five couches. What's your favorite Netflix original series right now? I'd love to know in the comments below. Also, if you enjoyed this video, give it a like, and don't forget to share and subscribe. I'm Chris, this is Movies and Munchies. Thanks for couching with me.